The social media bill has drawn a lot of negative attention due to the ambiguity of the details of the bill. Task Creative Agency held a conference on the 10th of March 2020, led by Emaya Baga, who spoke on the importance of the event. And we are organizing this event today for um, bringing entertainers together to discuss this piece of legislation that the Senate is proposing that will limit the freedoms on the, social, on the internet and social media. Um, it's very troubling, especially in light with a lot of things that are happening in government. And we want to get a group of entertainers to come together and stand against it and say no. Many are concerned about the danger of the social media bill to the entertainment industry. You can't separate the entertainment industry from social media. It's part and parcel of, of the package. Um, so for entertainers <clears throat> to be able to express their thoughts and their views um, um, and, and the way that they engage with their audiences and their fans, uh, I think entertainers should probably be at least as concerned as anybody else, if not more concerned, because social media is a, a huge part of what entertainers do. So the bill has passed the first and second reading, and now we are one, we're trying to make sure it doesn't get to the third reading. It doesn't go past here. Um, it's not just entertainers, it's all hands on deck. I don't know, yesterday there was a public hearing and the outcry was insane. There were government agencies that didn't stand by the bill, a lot of CSOs, but at the same time, we, the entertainment industry, want to say that this is not going to happen. What can citizens do to ensure that the bill isn't enacted into law? Um, educate yourselves. Um, go out, read, um, ask questions. The problem is we just take things for what they are. We don't really ask questions. I know there's a lot of fear behind all of this. That's the truth. Um, fear has been put in, <laughs> you know, the fear of God too has been put in a lot of people. But the idea is also be afraid that if you have no rights or you're not able to speak out or be able to express yourself, you know, those, those mental battles are going to be worse. It's very clear. Again, um, people like Tasco, so if you search the hashtag, kill the bill, hashtag, um, leave my social media alone, you will see. Contact your representatives. So that's senators, people in the House of Rep. Go to the website nassnig.org. That's nationalassemblynigeria.org. Go to nassnig.org. You'll see a, a link at the top that says legislators. Click on the legislator and a whole reel of legislators will come out. When that comes out, it also comes with a phone number and an email address. All that you have to do is call, even if they don't pick up, send an email to say, I am this, this, this of this area, you are my representative, and I do not want you to vote in support of the bill. The benefits of freedom of social media cannot be overemphasized. Regulation without stifling is important, and this is the reason why it is necessary that these hard conversations are had so that our voices are heard. For PLUS TV Africa, Nimi Adekombi.